everybody. This is Randy Santel, Atlas, and I am very, very excited today because I'm going for overall win number 971, and I am back on the beautiful island of Anna Maria Island. We've got lots of people here, which is much appreciated. Yes. I was here earlier in this trip when I did that giant favorites challenge at Harry's Grill with the prime rib and everything else. But today, I'm for the first time on Holmes Beach. I am at the Ugly Grouper. I'm the first person to help kick off and take on their new Ugly Grouper Challenge. Now, this is so much food that I have to finish all within one hour. I'm gonna start off, I think, actually with these chicken wings here. There's like 12 of their smoked chicken wings. Can't wait to eat those. We've got this Randy Santel size, they call it. This is not a normal size. If you come here, it's gonna be a little bit smaller for you, but I've got a two pound Ugly Grouper taco. This thing, it's got a cheese skirt. There is like one and a half pounds of their grouper, which is locally sourced, just like on this Ugly Grouper sandwich. We've got this along with some of their fries. Those even look great. I'm really excited, very, very excited to bite into this. This is their Ugly Polynesian boat. Took me a while to get used to that, but it is a pineapple filled with risotto and then healthy vegetables. And then on top, we've got a big old thing of their grouper, and then it is all topped with their mango habanero sauce. Over here is one of their top appetizers. I love green tomatoes. We've got a whole bunch of their fried green tomatoes along with fresh crab on top. And then what kind of sauce is it? It is a Cajun remoulade. Along with that, this is another appetizer, but we've got four of their ugly cheese logs filled with mozzarella cheese, right? Yes, these are not part of the challenge, but along the way, I'm gonna try to finish two of their signature drinks. We've got a perfect margarita, and then we've got a beach babe filled with healthy fruit-like juices. But one hour, if I fail, it's gonna be around $125. But if I win, I'll get my entire meal for free. I will get a sweet t-shirt to add to my collection, and I'll be the very first person with my name and photo here at the Ugly Grouper on their wall of fame. Let's get this challenge started. <laughs> All right, big thank you to everybody with the Ugly Grouper for having me in to help kick off this challenge. I think I'm going to start off with the wings first, then maybe do some of these cheese logs and move on to all the other foods. But let's just shut up and eat. One, two, three, boom. All righty. Do these before they get too cold. And if I need, I got ranch sauce right here and marinara. Oh yeah, those are good. I don't often get dry wings, these are good. I just realized I'm an idiot. I totally forgot to mention the shrimp cocktail I have to finish, which has their ugly sauce, which is like a spicy cocktail. It looks amazing. We'll do that after we finish up these wings. One wing left before we do that, let's eat some of these cheese logs. Marinara sauce first. Thankfully, my jaw feels a lot better today. That uh, sandwich a couple days ago, that pork sandwich, that about killed my jaw. Yesterday was tough too, but I'm feeling good today. We're gonna dominate this meal. All right, last wing. Let's try it in the ranch. We just passed five minutes in. I like these cheese sticks because they're not like cooked to the point where there's a whole bunch of cheese pull. It's pretty firm cheese. I really enjoy it. Last bit of this. 
they told me I should start off with the Beach Babe, which has a whole bunch of deliciousness that I already forgot. I know there's cranberry and then blueberry vodka, so let's have some fruits. Fruit juice. Oh yeah, that is delicious. That'll go right down with all this food. Next, we'll move over to the shrimp cocktail. Thankfully not peel and eat shrimp. It's kind of the same amount of flavor you get from these. That is good. And then there definitely is a kick to this uh, ugly sauce. Not too bad though, definitely enjoyable. The longer this sits here, the scarier it gets. I'm gonna start working on this ugly grouper taco. Katina's doing the challenge after me. She will have a shrimp taco, which sounds exciting, but uh, let's have this. I don't think I've had a cheese skirt on a taco in a long time, so let's enjoy it. This is with a 10 inch tortilla. The normal ones have a six inch tortilla. All of this is blackened grouper, which is so delicious. Compliments to the chef. Almost done with this taco. Couple bites left. Little bit left. Good right there for you, brother. Thank you, thank you. you. Got anything else? Oh no, that's great. Right on, man. Great hospitality here, as you can see, and then every day they have live music. Everything's outside here. It's an awesome atmosphere. Great to be here at the Ugly Grouper, but ooh, let's continue to shut up and eat and get the rest of all this down. All right, got a mostly big spoon for all this debris. So much grouper in here, thankfully it was awesome. All done. All done with the taco. That was a big old taco. Very happy to be done with that. Now we're gonna move on to the fried green tomatoes. Topped with crab. And then their remoulade, Cajun remoulade sauce. Healthy green tomatoes, just not healthy stuff on them. All right, right at 24 minutes in, last piece of the fried green tomatoes. This is the best kind of crab because I don't have to crack it. This has been awesome. Trying to leave no doubt, get the last pieces of crab. This pineapple is all cored, so there's no real pineapple to eat. It's all the filling on the inside. I am gonna do this next though because there's a mango habanero salsa uh, on top that might be a bit spicy. And then I gotta finish this grouper too. There's like a sweet Thai chili sauce you can put on this thing too, but I went with mango habanero. Keep it fruity. Right at 30 minutes in, last bite of the grouper that's on top of this. Now time for the healthy vegetables and risotto, which has rice and lots of other stuff. I 
I knew this was gonna be good based on how good that pineapple thing I had at that Mexican restaurant in uh, Boone, North Carolina last year. And this is good. Just very different. Getting to the end of the tour. I'm happy I'm going home soon. Three challenges left after this, but ooh, we are enjoying this. Last bite of the Polynesian boat. Ooh, the ugly Polynesian boat, but it was so beautiful. Gonna have some of the juices left over. The pineapple is gone. We're definitely gonna get this along with hopefully the drinks. Oh, then I can have some more drinks while watching Katina. This is a lot of food. Anybody that says different is wrong. Let us do the sandwich and then we'll finish off with the fries. There's a nice cold diet soda coming that's gonna save me. I was thinking about since we started this challenge at noon having dinner somewhere on Anna Maria Island tonight and I don't think that's gonna happen. minutes and 55 seconds in I need just a minute thankful I got the ketchup if I was eating these fries warm they'd be delicious they look great just oh I'm getting full I do want to at least try the margarita so let me get rid of this beach babe while I'm still feeling good all right beach babe's gone 45 minutes in, 15 to go. Let's just try this perfect margarita. All right, last bits. Got it. I am getting old. Time to let the kids do all this stuff and uh, stop all this nonsense. But this food is just too good. I'm just addicted, gotta keep going. I'm gonna try to finish off this perfect margarita I started with. 49 minutes in now. Delicious, perfect margarita here at the Ugly Grouper dominated the challenge. Yeah. Ah. Yeah. This is the new record to beat. I am, of course, the first person to win. 49 minutes and 37 seconds. Yes. Ooh. Big thank you to everybody here with the Ugly Grouper for having me in to help kick off their challenge. I've got to say my favorite I don't really know what my favorite was. Of course the grouper, but I've got to say it had the most love in it, the most care. They made it specially for me and they're making a Katina sized taco <laughs> after me. But that delicious, ugly grouper taco with like one and a half pounds of their blackened grouper, that was delicious. Loved the fried green tomatoes with the crab and that sauce, the cheese sticks, the wings, everything was delicious. Enjoyed the shrimp as well. I am going to get the about $125 meal for free, which did not include the drinks. I am going to get a sweet t-shirt and 
If you come here, be sure to check out their store. They've got all kinds of ugly grouper merchandise, which is awesome, not just shirts. Uh, I had a bunch of options. I ended up picking this one. Uh, it says the Ugly Grouper here on Anna Maria Island, Florida. Thanks again to everybody here with the Ugly Grouper. It was overall win number 971. Thank you guys for watching too.